Hello, I'm Glenn Ferguson. In this free video and report, I'm going to share with you some very important information about early retirement's five questions you need to answer before taking the package. By the way, make sure you get on my VIP list as soon as possible by visiting my blog and signing up. When you do, you'll get immediate access to more of these exclusive videos with me where I share some of the key strategies for a successful and boring-free retirement. And I will also give you special early access to my upcoming seminar, Strategies for Achieving a Comfortable Retirement, yours, and other benefits. Again, just go to my blog and join my VIP list. It's free. So let's learn about those five questions you need to answer before taking an early retirement package. It is not surprising these days to hear about persons being offered and receiving early retirement package from their employers. This is just one of a number of restructuring and downsizing methods used by the corporate world to cut costs, and most likely will be used quite frequently given the current economic circumstances. So whether you're part of the private or government sector, it is something you'd better get used to. And that is why it is so important that you fully understand what you are getting before accepting an early retirement package. There is no question that these package can be quite attractive. And that is the intent of the employer to make it as attractive as possible from a cash in hand perspective, but it may or may not be a good choice for you. Hopefully, once you've watched this video, you'll be empowered to look carefully at what you are getting before accepting, even if you don't have an option to refuse them. So what is this all about? An early retirement package is an offer of money in return for you retiring at an earlier time than you had planned. Most companies include a severance pay based on your annual salary and your years of service. An early retirement package might also include benefits such as health or life insurance. The first of the five questions you need to be able to answer is, can I afford this change? To answer this question, you must have a clear picture of your current financial situation, your family's needs, and whether or not you will have enough money to continue living the lifestyle you're accustomed to for the years of early retirement. If you had planned to retire at age 65 and you are now retiring at age 55, will you have enough money to support you for the additional 10 years? Four steps you can take to prepare financially and make the transition less dramatic are eliminate any major debts, including mortgages and car payments. Create a peace of mind account to deal with any emergencies. Those will definitely pop up. Reduce or eliminate your credit card debt as quickly as possible. And practice living on or less than you earn. That's going to be key. The second question is, do I have adequate and appropriate insurance coverage? Your employer may include health insurance in your early retirement package, but most don't, so don't count on it. And even if it is included, you may have to pay the cost, and the cost may force you to get your own coverage. So you need to ensure that you and your family have adequate medical insurance coverage. Your best bet may be an individual medical insurance plan or possibly coverage for your spouse's employment. Secondly, you may be able to continue your life insurance coverage, but this is usually very limited. And again, you could be responsible for the costs. If your employer doesn't offer life insurance, then it's important that you get your own coverage. The third question is, what will I get as my monthly retirement benefit? If your company has a pension plan, you usually can't start drawing from that plan until you reach a certain age. But the good thing about this is the longer you wait, the more your monthly benefit check will be. But you should discuss all of your options and entitlements with your company's plan administrator or human resources department. Question four, what will I get as my monthly national insurance benefits? That's very important because social security benefits will certainly help you through this period. It is important to know that early retirement benefit payments from national insurance does not start until age 60. So if you retire earlier than age 60, you have to wait for this benefit. Also, if you rejoin the workforce after age 60, your weekly salary must be less than $200 or $867 monthly to continue to receive national insurance benefit. It's something you have to consider. And finally, question number five, what am I going to do? Apart from all the money issues, I feel this is the most important question you have to answer. You may have been working for 30 to 40 years, and now that is all coming to an end. So what are you really going to do? Believe it or not, 
Retirement has killed more persons than hard work ever will. That's why it's so important that you know what you're going to do. You may not have realized it, but besides providing you with financial stability, work also provided four other benefits. It provided you an opportunity to socialize, it gave you a structured and scheduled environment. It provided status and sense of importance and also gave you a sense of utility. Now that you will no longer be at work, you must find activities to involve yourself in that will provide these benefits. You can expect that with the current economic conditions, that companies will continue to downsize and as a result offer early retirement packages, which is why you've got to begin now to think about what you're going to do with all this newfound freedom that you will be presented with. So let's recap the five questions you need to answer before taking a retirement package. Question one, can I afford this change? Question two, do I have appropriate and adequate insurance protection? Question three, what will I get as my monthly retirement benefit? Question four, what will I get as my monthly national insurance benefit? And question five, the most critical question you have to answer is, what am I going to do? Now it's time for you to answer these five questions about your own retirement. Why? Because you just never know when you will be the next person to be offered an early retirement package. So it is best to be prepared. To continue your retirement education, make sure you get on my VIP list right away as this will allow you to continue to learn key lessons about retirement and get more free reports, as well as early access to my strategies for achieving a comfortable retirement seminar and other benefits. Thank you for watching this special retirement video, and I'll talk to you in another of my special videos when you join my VIP list. Remember, retirement is the most expensive purchase you will ever make, and it's the one thing you won't be able to borrow for.